When Leslie was diagnosed with cystinuria, a rare kidney stone disease, she was concerned about how it would impact her busy life. Having cystinuria means she will continuously form cysteine stones. Leslie wanted to learn about cystinuria and what she could do to reduce her chances of forming stones. The information she found online didn't answer all of her questions. She found a doctor who helped explain the condition and what she can do to help prevent cysteine stones from forming. At her appointment, Leslie's doctor explained their main goal is to reduce the level or concentration of cysteine in her urine so stones won't form, generally under 250 milligrams per liter. So how does Leslie make that happen? Her doctor explained she has four ways, or levers, that she has to manage her cystinuria. The first lever is the amount of fluid she drinks in a day. Drinking fluid can help lower the cysteine concentration in Leslie's urine, which makes it more difficult for cysteine crystals to bind and form stones. The American Urological Association recommends that people with cystinuria drink at least four liters every day with a goal of excreting two and a half liters of urine. The second is to make her urine more alkaline or less acidic. This means raising her urine pH level to 7.0. If Leslie's urine is less acidic, then it is more difficult for cysteine stones to form. Simply adding citrus to her diet is not enough so her doctor prescribed a medication that can make her urine less acidic. The third is to decrease the amount of salt and animal protein in her diet. To reduce her cysteine concentration, Leslie checks nutrient labels and tries to keep salt or sodium intake under 2300 milligrams a day, careful not to add any additional salt to her meals. One teaspoon of salt contains about 2300 milligrams of sodium. She also limits animal protein to 60% or less of her total daily protein intake. The fourth is to take a thiol-binding medication. If the first three levers aren't enough and Leslie is still forming stones, her doctor may prescribe a thiol-binding medication. This medication works by binding to cysteine, which makes it more soluble and lowers the amount of cysteine in the urine. This helps prevent stones from forming. Leslie works with her doctor and uses the results of her 24-hour urine cysteine test to monitor her cysteine level. They can then work to adjust these four levers to keep her cysteine level under 250 milligrams per liter. Don't allow cystinuria to disrupt your life. Talk to your doctor about how to include these changes to your cystinuria management plan.